Mastering adverbs of frequency with past continuous tense. Hello, English learners. Today, we're diving deep into an interesting topic. Adverbs of frequency with past continuous tense. These adverbs tell us how often an action was happening in the past. Stay with us as we explore examples and how to use them correctly. Before we get into adverbs of frequency, let's briefly recall what the past continuous tense is. This tense is used to describe an ongoing action that took place at a specific time in the past. It is formed using the past tense of the auxiliary verb, to be, was, were, and the present participle, base verb plus ing. Example, I was reading a book yesterday evening. They were playing football when it started to rain. Now, let's talk about adverbs of frequency. These words tell us how often something happens or happened. They include words like always, usually, often, sometimes, occasionally, rarely, and never. When using adverbs of frequency with the past continuous tense, it usually indicates a repeated action or habit in the past. When you combine adverbs of frequency with the past continuous tense, it can help paint a clearer picture of how frequently an action was happening in the past. It's important to note that the adverb of frequency generally goes between the auxiliary verb and the main verb. Example, I was always losing my keys when I lived in that big house. She was often singing while doing her homework. There are always exceptions in English grammar. Some adverbs of frequency can also go at the beginning or end of a sentence, especially when you want to give them extra emphasis. Example, sometimes they were arguing about who should do the dishes. He was feeling sad occasionally. There you have it. Now, you've learned how to use adverbs of frequency with past continuous tense to make your English more descriptive and accurate. Keep practicing, as it's through practice that we become better. Remember, English is a journey, not a destination. Thank you for watching, and stay tuned for more lessons.